Hello, all you space engineers out there. Commander Kingfish here, and it is day 30 here on Planet 26. Well, if you remember in the last episode, we were building away on our observation tower when we ran out of silicon. Now, and that's because we, I was using so much stuff, uh, had so much glass built into it, that uh, I used up all my silicon in, in, in making the uh, bulletproof glass. So I am got uh, three alternatives on what I can do about that. And none of them are all that very much appealing. Uh, I have... Uh, I can uh, go and try to grind parts off of uh, the old mining settlement uh, and uh, hopefully get some uh, bulletproof glass out of uh, there uh, and I don't know how much is really left over there because we've already pulled quite a bit off of the uh, the old ship and then the rest of the stuff is uh, there I don't think there's much in the way of silicon uh, that's the first that's an option the other option is to go mine, uh, hand mine a bunch of stone. I have the one drill set up over there that uh, is uh, mining stone, but it's not mining it very fast. So as it is coming in, I've been dropping it in, but it doesn't utilize it's just not uh, pulling in that much silicon uh, because it's got all the gravel and stuff that it uh, uh, pulls in. And you can see uh, that it's not uh, pulling in all that much. So if, let's, if we go over to the refinery, I can take and grab this and drop it right there and you'll see that it gets used up. And then the silicon, as fast as it's being produced is getting sucked over which isn't very much so I can go and uh, do that and then the third option is to go and actually find a silicon field and I think that is probably the best option uh, I can fly I can take one of the drones up here and it's got uh, quite a bit of cargo space, so I can take all the parts that I need uh, to set up a mining operation, just like I did with iron and the uh, stone uh, and the nickel and uh, the cobalt. So I prob that's probably what I should do is uh, go and just set up a mining uh, facility uh, over there. I'm not going to try to run a pipeline and I'm not going to try to set up a uh, automated drone system to it uh, since I've already got since I've already done that with uh, cobalt uh, that seemed to work pretty good uh, and then if if and as I need resources I can uh, go ahead and just fly over there and pick up the uh, silicon. So what I need to do is uh, try to grip all the parts that I can. Uh, the problem with taking, you know, what I actually really should do is drive the planet rover over there because it has the ore detector on it and it's going to be out this direction. I think the silicon field is out this direction uh, beyond the uranium mine. So it could be a bit of a, a drive over there. Uh, and then again, we're going to have to deal with the ember uh, transports and drones and stuff like that. But we are capable. We've ran into that before. So I think that is going to be the solution. Uh, so what I'm going to start doing is loading up the parts onto the planet rover. Because uh, the other thing with taking the planet rover 
is I have a uh, I have the ability to produce parts if I need more parts on there so that's what I'm going to do let me start getting parts loaded up and then I will uh, catch back up with you here in just a little bit Well, I think I am pretty well stocked up. I just hate seeing the sun going down. Uh, but uh, I think we are ready to start rolling. Uh, hopefully, we can uh, find that silicon. And it's going to be out in that direction. The uranium mine is that way. And it should be, well, quite a little ways beyond that but uh, hopefully we're not going to end up in too much rough terrain and let's see what we can do to get out there all right let's hop in this uh, let's take the parking brake off uh, let's go outside the cabin and we'll just start backing out this way and I think we want to head head out this away and and let's just kind of see what happens here hopefully we don't run into any uh, of the ember so we can squeeze through right here. Alright, as I get a little bit closer, uh, I will uh, get back with you. But first, let me say, uh, uh, please subscribe. It really helps the channel out. And please uh, uh, hit that like button and, and hit the bell to, so that you get reminders. So... Uh, all right, I will uh, catch back up with you here in a little bit as I get closer.
Well, as you can see, the going is getting a little rougher. We have to go through this savanna type area, trying to miss some of the trees, but we're just kind of plowing through. Good thing is that these don't, trees don't cause any damage and it just kind of gets them out of the way. As you can see off to the right, uh, that is the uh, nickel mine, and so I think I need to stay towards the left here. Uh, I'm hoping I'm going to be able to find this uh, silicon field. It should be should be fairly obvious once I get out there. I'm trying to get to a a desert, so once I get through this savanna then I should be able to pretty much see where I'm going uh, as we get out there. So uh, we're going to uh, keep blowing our way through here. All right, I'm hoping this is the right direction. That's all I got to say. I think that peak there on the uh, right is uh, kind of an indicator. I think I should be, once I get kind of past this, I should start seeing a more of a desert, desert sand area. So the only question is, as long as we don't uh, run into any cliffs and stuff, we should be okay. I managed to navigate through all of the the em embers uh, spaces, so we're just going to keep pushing forward. Okay, this is starting to look good. I I should be coming into this uh, savanna type place, uh, which it should be kind of out in the middle, so... So, we're not doing too bad, I think. Now, the question is, can we find it? I'm kind of looking for a landmark. There should be, like, a lone, single, rocky outcrop. Well, as you can see, daylight is coming. I'm going to run to the up above up here and see if I can't see out over the plane a little bit uh, and see if I can't spot what I'm looking for. Uh, our base is back that away, about uh, 36 kilometers. The nickel mine, I think, is off in that direction. All right, can we look out a little bit higher up? Let's see if we can kind of get up to the top up here. Uh, I am not sure where I am at, if you want to know the truth. 
I don't think this is the outcropping I was looking for. I think this might be one a little bit closer. I think I gotta head back out in that direction. So we'll run back to the uh, planet rover and we're just gonna head out in that direction and see what we can find. Worst case scenario, uh, I'm gonna have to go back to the base and uh, grab a drone and fly out here and see if I can find it. I thought bringing the planet rover would uh, be the best just because I have everything on there but oh you know hindsight's always 2020 so let's see how we do here. Uh, we've got some daylight uh, but I'm pretty sure this is not what I was looking for. I think I need to head well I think I need to head kind of north northwest out in that direction that's one of the things with this uh, planet uh, the resources are scattered they're not uh, all clumped together so uh, we've been pretty lucky in finding just about everything that we needed uh, uh, I but I just knew that uh, silicon was going to be a problem but I was hoping that I was going to be able to get enough out of mining rocks and that just hasn't proven to be be the case all right let's uh, release the brake let's get turned around here I think I see something there in the distance. This might be what we're looking for. We're out here in the middle of the desert. Alright, let's keep our fingers crossed. Better slow down a little bit. We don't want to get in too much trouble out here. I think that valley right there is going to be about the safest way to get down. I hope. Otherwise, we could be in a world of hurt. Slow and easy. Wow, this is getting steeper. Can we do it? Well, that looks pretty damn steep. Ah, uh, we better... Better take a look take a closer look see what we can do here oh uh, I think we can make it down through there not sure why those patrol drones keep wanting to get closer to us. But let's give it a try. I think what I want to be able to do is if I can get to the silicon field today, then this will be a pretty good uh, uh, a pretty good thing. Let's uh, top in here, unpark it.
thought silicon would be a problem. Ah, silicon. Oh, and there's that little lake uh, I was looking for. All right. Here's, oh, look at this. There it is, we found it. Okay, you know what? I am going to park this right here. And uh, I think, I think this is a good spot to call the episode good right here. Let's park this. Let's uh, get out and take a look. Uh, just take a walk around. Oh, yeah. Look at this. All right. Well, the first thing we're going to do before, before I quit, we're going to... Let's do this. GPS. Let's uh, new current position. Silicon field. Actually, we're just going to call it silicon mine. Uh, actually, why don't I do it the way I'm supposed to do it? Let's go silicon. Let's go M dash. There we go. And that should have that GPS marker. If we back up, there it is right there. Okay. Okay, well, we are out here in the vast wilderness on planet 26. We found our silicon mine. The next next episode, we will actually build build our mine, build our resources. Uh, we don't have any of these, it's the drones, the patrol drones are 10, 11 kilometers away, so we shouldn't have to worry about them, so we'll be able to build up here. All right, all you space engineers out there, if you like this video, please hit that thumbs up on the video. It really helps the video out a lot, and uh, please subscribe. That really helps the channel. All right, all you space engineers out there, keep your heads low, keep building away, and don't get shot. And with that, Commander Kingfish is out of here, and I will see you all in the next video. Thanks for watching, everyone.